Hey everybody, so we're going to talk about a free CTC tool um, called Renumbering. And it's it's a really great tool. It's, it makes renumbering sections really easy. And it can renumber other things as well, such as uh, rooms or doors, um, grids and whatnot. And um, in this example here, you can see that we have a number of sections and they're kind of out of order. So it goes from two, four, five, six seven, one, and three. We want to renumber this as one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's a really easy tool to, to, to use, so we'll go ahead and jump into it. So in the CTC tab, if we click this CTC BIM Project Suite panel, we can extend this free tools, and then down here is renumbering. If we click on that, it'll pop up a dialog box, and you can see up here there's a number of tabs for rooms, doors, grids, detail numbers in general. We're gonna jump to detail numbers and we're gonna want to start this sequence at one and uh, we're not gonna add a prefix or separator or suffix, but those options are there. You'll wanna turn on auto swap if you're gonna be starting with um, at a sequence where there's other sections that already exist. So for example, this you know, uh, one section already exists in here. So if we don't have that checked, it's just gonna give us a warning that, hey, this section already exists. You're about to rename this one. You can't do that. So keep that in mind. If we were to set this at eight and start renumbering, then we wouldn't have a, a problem. Uh, so in this example, we're setting it to one. We have auto swap detail number on, and then now we can just click renumber. And then when you're finished, you just uh, press escape. So I'll start with this first one. We want this to be one. You can see that's uh, one now, two, three, four, five. And this is set to six, so we could press escape, but we could go ahead and just keep clicking through these if we want. Um, if you do click on a, a previous one, it will prompt you you know, uh, and ask you, hey, is that something you, you really want to do? Um, so you can keep clicking through them, but if they um, if it's already at the section number you want, then you can just click escape uh, from that. So we clicked escape. We're done. Um, so now what we can do is just close this. Uh, we will have to go in here and rename these, but um, you know it depends on if you do give it a section name. So in this example, it's called section seven, but if you gave it some defined name without a, um, a section um, number on there, then um, obviously you wouldn't have to rename it. Uh, but so as you can see, it starts at one, two, three, and it goes all the way to seven. So it's really easy to do. It's a great tool. Um, so definitely check it out. Uh, and let me know if you have any questions. Thanks a lot for watching.